Learning Management System. Let's look at three types of learning management systems, Moodle, Blackboard, and Google Classroom. Okay, let's look at the first LMS, Moodle. Moodle is an LMS that was designed to provide educators, administrators, and learners with an open, robust, secure, and free platform to create and deliver personalized learning environments. Moodle is a free, user-friendly learning management system that supports learning and training needs for a wide range of institutions and organizations across the globe. Now, Moodle stands for Modular Object Oriented Dynamic Learning Environment. Let me sit and think of Moodle's components. One. Access to learning materials anytime, anywhere, with any organized e-learning environment. Two, consistent content delivery and feedback. Three, opportunities for blended learning approach. Four, time saving for teachers. And don't forget that it's open source and free download. Our next LMS is Blackboard. Now, Blackboard is a web-based course management system designed to allow students and faculty to participate in class delivered online or use online materials and activities to complement face-to-face teaching. Blackboard enables instructors to provide students with course materials, discussion boards, visual charts, online quizzes, an academic resource center, and much, much more. Blackboard categorized under Common Core, Inventional Learning or Inventive Learning, and Open Classroom Options. As I sat and thought about Moodle, let me think about Blackboard's components. One. Variety of methods to involve students' engagement. Encourage social distancing learning for two. Reliable. Use any device anytime. Three. And number four. There are four target audience. K-12, high education, government, and business. How can we forget the cost? It's reasonable. Next and final LMS on our list is Google Classroom. Google Classroom is a free web service developed by Google for schools that aims to simplify creating, distributing, and grading assessments. The primary purpose of Google Classroom is to streamline the process of sharing files between teachers and students. Now, did you know that Google Classroom was originally launched in 2014 as an exclusive tool for school systems? I am still thinking of LMS components. Let's look at Google Classroom. One, supplements the classroom rather than recreate it. Two, preparation for higher education. Three, no lost work. Four, Consistent of improvement, collaboration, encouragement, differentiation, and feedback. And guess what? It's free. Similarities of Google Classroom, Blackboard, and Moodle. They are useful for K-12 classrooms, can be used anytime, anywhere, collaboration and communication, easy to use, can be used for online, flipped, and blended classrooms. Differences between the three LMS. Their cost, features, available only on some devices, only offer some support system, and last, types of users are different.